So last, my name is Patch, and today we are finally back. It's been like a week now because of obviously what's happened. Some of you may already know already because I've spoke to some of my subscribers because they had the privilege to message me. And um, all I gotta say is just thank you for the support and stuff. It's been tough, but um, I'll try and go through this video, and hopefully we'll be back to normal soon. But um, during the meantime, because of what happened, I haven't recorded anything on this game. I've just been recording, I've, I've just been playing offline, sorry is what I meant. And uh, I'll show you what I've done. I've managed to make some profit on players as well, which are in my transfer list. I'll go through that and stuff. But um, the only update I can give you is I've played a few games of Divisions. I've done a bit of squad battles as well. I only managed to get four games in because obviously I had to leave the country. Like, literally after I played these games, so that's fine. And you may have noticed I've got 50k as well because... In my squad battle rewards, I packed Bakayoka and Salah. Literally, I don't know how, like, what was the chance of that, but I managed to do that. And Salah only sold for 21k, which um, at the time that was his lowest, but now he's like 30k, so I did a mistake selling him at that time. And Bakayoka sold for 18k, which was a mistake as well. But um, yeah, I learned from a mistake. Same with Laporte. I think at the time, all the prices were like really low. I think they've all gone back up now. Maybe I should have waited a bit longer, but I just wanted coins whilst I was away, just so I can like maybe open packs or build a team, and that's what I did anyway. Uh, Laporte, I also got this guy to pack. So my pack has been pretty good actually off camera, and um, I got these in silver gift packs. I mean, that guy was worth a bit. Um, that guy only sold 150 coins, and yeah, and all I've got here is just Liverpool players. I tried to make profit on these Liverpool players since like Manny got player of the month. I thought you have to have Liverpool players in the SBCs, turns out not, so buying these were like was kind of a risk and it didn't pay off, but that's fine, that's fine, you know. We got these 99 contracts, which I'll save like 600 coins at the moment, so I could go off and sell them. I've also got a lot of non rare contracts, I've got, I think I've got about 40 of them. So I could try and sell them as well, and this is my team. Then I've got two teams. I've got I built this La Liga team whilst I was away. Literally, I was in the airport <laughs> when building this team just before my flight, and um, I managed to build this team as well, which is a Serie A team. I mean, Akadi, he's pretty cheap. He's, he's only like two k, which is absolutely mad. I can't wait to use him. I managed to get Felipe Anderson, Niang, actually Niang before to be fair. I got De Rossi, Allen and him. That guy looks sick, I can't wait to use him. And um, yeah, that's pretty much all I've done really. And um, since I packed Bakayoko and Salah, I managed to get 50k. I managed to sell my other teams and make profit on them as well because the prices went up and I managed to build the current team we've got at the moment. So we are doing well at the moment. Also, since I got the Icon Edition, I managed to get Brazilian Ronaldo, the prime version, for five games. I cannot wait to use this guy. This guy was probably my hero growing up. I mean, he was probably everyone's football hero growing up. The best striker in the history of the game, without a doubt. This guy, in his prime, was unbelievable. If you had never seen Ronaldo play in the Brazilian world, just, just YouTube it. He was literally the most complete player I've ever seen in my whole life. Unfortunately, injuries grew in there. Maybe if he never had them injuries, he could have been the best player in the history of football. I reckon he's up there anyway, without a doubt. He was like on another level. He was that good, I think 96 is too low. I reckon he should be 98. Or even 99. He's, he, he was just that good. He was... Bruv. But yeah, I've got him. I've also got Ronaldo for eight games. Reason why I've got eight on them because obviously, if you could get the icon edition, you get him for five games, and if you buy him off the catalog, you get him for three games. I just combined the two, and that made eight, so that makes sense. Then we got all these other loan players. I managed to get Griezmann in the ultimate loan pack as well, which was really sick. Um, I got that from doing one of the SBs. Was it SBs? I can't remember what I did to get that. Was it an SBC? In, I think, no, it was one of the starter objectives. I think, like, near the end, you get, like, an ultimate loan pack. I got Griezmann. I played two games of him. I scored four goals and one assist. I mean, it's pretty decent. And we got Carrasco as well, who I got in a... I think that was a premium loan pack, which was quite lucky. That's the highest rate of play you can get in them. And, um, yeah, that's all my loans, really. And that's literally the rest of the players I've got. So... What we're going to do this episode is try and qualify for the weekend league because that starts in like four days and I want to be playing this weekend league and there's no requirements so I might as well do it because tomorrow's requirements you need a 78 and then no requirements again but I have to wait like 
two days or three days. I just can't be waiting that long. So I'm just going to play it now, get it over and done with. And um, yeah, maybe once we play this, I can. I need to carry my squad battle games. What I'll probably do, I'll play them offline, the squad battle ones, and um, show you what I did in the next episode because I'm on silver two at the moment. And I'm hoping I can get at least silver one because obviously I won't really make it to like gold three because I've missed like the whole week of it. But um, you know it is what it is. So we'll just play this and hopefully we can qualify straight away. I haven't played FIFA in like a week, so hopefully I'm still good. I'm praying anyway. So what teams does guy have then? He's got okay. He's got Dwight Gale. I have no idea how good he is this year, I've not even seen his stats. Bakayoko, who I packed. Butland. I'm not sure if Butland's good in this game, hopefully he's shit this year, because last year, well, I don't need to say anything how good he was last year. Go on, go on. No! What the hell? Yes, there you go. Come on, one nil. Well, yes, yes, that went in. That's why I was like, yes, yes, twice. I didn't think that was going in in the end, but it did. Sick. Right, first round done, and I won 2 0. I got a feeling this guy might win in shots because literally. Towards the end of the game, he had about like five corners in a row, all saved by my goalkeeper. Hence why he made ten saves. So let's, so let's have a look at these stats quickly. Does that confirm it? Yeah, there you go. They were pretty much all in the 90th minute, so it doesn't matter. So yeah, on to the next one. Yeah, I should win this game. Wow. I thought that went wide then. That was a good finish. Wow, okay, fair play. Oh, fucking hell. He's literally had two shots and they've all went in. Both of them. That's unbelievable. Come on. Is that in? Yeah, okay, we've got one back. Right, let's hope we get another one now. Without conceding. Come on. Wow. Shoot! Yes, 2-2. Two, two. My God, that was so close. I thought I was going to miss then. Yes! I came back. I always come back from 2-0 down this game. It's happened so many times. Never die attitude. Like I said, maybe episode 2 or 1. I can't remember which one it was. But, yeah, get in. There you go. I'm absolutely all over this guy. You got two lucky goals, little prick. Oh, I'm absolutely gas. I'm doing the Homer Simpson dance. I mean, I did that when I was in Ireland to cheer me up, and it made everyone laugh. So I'm doing it again, and the guy's like paused it. Like, he wants to pause it. I'm cruising, come on. Ho, ho, ho. Just quit, mate. I'm ripping this guy apart. This guy is sick. Not the guy I'm playing against, I'm all about Philippe Anderson. Look at that, sick play as well. I just bang, the keeper didn't even move. Yep, that's six. And that's seven. Now we got his fifth. Wow, that's nine now. Is that Cardi? Who scored that? Is that Anderson? Is that Filippi Anderson again? That's why he's got like six goals this game. No, it's Perotti. Oh, okay. Right, look at these stats then. Uh, Anderson did get five. Four assists for a Cardi. My God. Probably the best I've played all year, to be fair. Yeah, just look at them stats. Just, just say no more. So, right, for this game, I'm going to go with this La Liga team. But I am tempted to drop Ben Yedder just for this game and put Ronaldo up front. Should I do that? Actually, no, I won't. I'll do that in the final. 
Oh yeah, that's Cristiano Ronaldo. I'll save the Brazilian Ronaldo for the weekend league, just so we can try and get a really high finish in the first week. I'm hoping this doesn't affect my performance because I've been doing so well with the Serie A team, but this team is almost as good, so I'm hoping I can continue my form. And this guy's got like a League One non-rare team, well, slash, so slash, slash La Liga as well, uh, and Premier League. It's a bit of a weird team to be fair. Surprised how he. Looking at that, I'm trying to think how he got top cam, but... Oh well, that's not my problem. Oh no. Oh my god, that was so close. Oh fuck, it's a goal kick as well, what? How am I... Oh. Wow. I've screwed up. I've had so many chances and I've just literally blown every single one. I've hit the bar, I've done loads of driven shots which have gone wide. And then that just comes back to punish me. I'm absolutely gutted. Finally, there you go, I've got one back. Oh, go on. Yes, is that going in? Don't go wide. Wow, we've hit the bar twice. Fuck this game, man. Yes. 90th minute winner. To be fair, I just whacked it for some reason. I normally don't shoot from there. I normally chip it or just cross it or driven shot it. But I just pressed B simply and it went in. That was a good finish though. Look at that. Ben Yedder with the pass. The threaded through ball, which is very useful in this game, and what a finish that is. On his weaker foot as well, I just got a hold on, I hope I don't concede. That's it, I've won. Into the final, come on. In this game, I'm going to put Ronaldo up front, I don't care. Not the Brazilian Ronaldo, the Cristiano. Where is he? Uh, oh no, what am I doing? I got, I got him on my club, what am I doing? What chem's he on? He's on four chem. If I change him to a left forward... I think he goes up to seven, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that. So Ronaldo starts on top chem, and he starts on free chem, which is fine with me anyway. I'd rather have Ronaldo on the highest chem, if you know what I mean. Right, fingers crossed this guy's got a shit team. He hasn't. He's got Sanchez, Ibrahimovic, Bakayoko, Vidal, Boateng, Alaba, Boy, Valencia, Matic, Farman, Willian... Do I say Ibrahimovic? I don't want to. Fucking hell, he's got a side, hasn't he? Yes, 1 0. This guy's very good, so I'm going to stay calm. Oh no. Let's go. Can't stop this guy. This guy's bought on Brazilian Ronaldo, and he's did that on me. I've been all over him. He's just too good in this game. That's literally undefendable. Oh, what the hell? Literally every shot he's had on target has actually gone in. Is actually unbelievable. This guy needs Ronaldo to carry him because he's that bad at this game. Ugh. Okay, I scored a goal, but I don't know if I've got enough time to come back. Because if I give this guy one shot with Ronaldo, then I'm fucked, so... Yeah. Oh, 3-3, free, free. okay. Right, calm down, because this guy's got Ronaldo, so I'm not getting too excited. Shoot! I scored in the 90th minute. I may have done it, but I'm not getting too carried away, because if he just runs with kickoff with Ronaldo, it could be a goal, so I'm just going to stay calm. To look here. Oh, no. What a save! Oh, my goodness me! That was probably the best save I've seen ever. And we've done it. That 90th minute save. 
Holy shit! My heart! I've done it. I've actually done it. Come on, I've qualified for the weekend league. Get in there. Right, we got a free pack as well, and I've done a daily objective. Oh, I've done two, haven't I? Let's have a look. S score goal of an Argentinian player. Who do I score with? Oh, Plotti, you know, Plotti, if you say his name. Now, all I've got to do is just do this. Win the game to a single player, which I'm probably not going to do. But let me claim these rewards quickly. We've got a gold gift pack. Okay. That's pretty sound. We could get decent players in these. I always do anyway. And 350 coins. Come on. Right, let's open this gold reward pack quickly. See if we get anything decent. They're always non rares so I completely forgot about that. But some players we can keep, you know. Maybe for SBCs in the future. So we'll keep that. In fact, we'll keep all of that, to be fair. And the premium gold pack. Pretty sure they are tradable, so see if I get anything decent. It's a non rare, okay. Another La Liga, though. Okay, alright. Two La Ligas. Oh, okay. So we got three rare contracts, which will keep uh, fitness. The Sentinels are pretty good. And we got Danny Simpson as well, who might sell. This might sell as well. Yeah, we'll try for 200 to see if it does so. And then uh, we'll discard that kit. So what I'm going to do now, guys, I'm going to play squad battles off camera because I've only got three hours left and there's no point. I'm not going to get a good reward anyway. I'm probably just going to get like a jumbo pack and two gold packs, which I'll open in the next episode tomorrow. And I'll end this one here and we'll carry on tomorrow. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe when you're around here, and I'll see you a lot later. Bye.